Okay, and we are rolling. Hi, I'm William Levine. Welcome to the debut episode of the William Levine Show. It's going to be a talk show molded after the, the old style talk shows, Steve Allen, Jack Parr, that sort of thing. This is our debut episode, and um, we're pleased to welcome a guest we worked hard to get, believe it or not. Um, it's David Phillips from the David Phillips Zoo. David? So good before no one has And now. Steve. William Levine. Ah. Again, sorry, Steve. I'm Levine. You're on, Bill. Hi, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the William Levine Show. It's our first episode. We're really excited tonight. Hope you are, too. Um, we're going to, as you know, this is going to be a new kind of show, but molded after an old kind of show. Jack Parr, Steve Allen talk show genre, which we were all so fond of, which unfortunately we no longer have a current example of. But anyway, um, we're real excited to be on the air. Um, Come to you live from our new studio, built especially for me, Bill Levine, according to my specifications. And uh, now I see uh, it's about time for our first guest. We're going to call him out here. He's a uh, host and uh, founder of his own zoo. How else can I put it? It's Dave Phillips, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks. Dave Phillips. Maybe. David, uh, let me just say, all, all of us here at the William Levine Show are excited to have you. Um, we worked hard with your representation, which, as you know, is some of the tops in the field. <laughs> They're not going to let you come on any show. And uh, the fact that you came on to have a few words with us, we're, we're honored, first of all. Get that no out problem. of the way. The uh, butt-kissing aspect of the show. Um, no problem. It's very good for us. Anyway, of us. anyway <laughs> it is. It is that. It is that, if nothing else. So, um, David, you know, you come to us with highly impressive credentials and uh, you know we're about at the end of the 20th century gonna enter the 21st century and people out there want to know what, what young men like you who are representative of our generation are, are gonna are thinking today